what is coming up on the channel, guys? Well, first of all, thank you so much. I mean, 2,000 subscribers, what? It must mean that I'm doing something right for you guys and you're getting something out of these videos. So, 2,000 subscribers, onwards and upwards. But what is coming up on the channel, I'm really excited about this um, thing I've composed for you. It's it's really melodic. I've been listening to your comments, you know, you, you really like the kind of melodic stuff I'm doing because it gives you something really nice to work with. So, we're gonna look at the left hand. But first of all, hang on a second. I just had to. Anyway, so the left hand, it's going to work in stages, so I'm going to show you this left hand um, in five different steps, you know, starting out really nice and simple and building it up to something that sounds advanced, and that's really good for two reasons. First, you're going to be able to play it no matter where you are on your piano journey because it's going to be really nicely set out in ability levels, but also it's going to give you a really nice insight into how we can actually build a left hand piano pattern from scratch, and you can see the mechanics and, on how that works and sort of build that into your own stuff and look at the kind of underlying mechanics of that. So I'm really excited about that. It's super melodic. You're going to love it. Check that out. Boogie Woogie. Okay, so Boogie Woogie. Uh, I've got a video coming out looking at the left hand, basic left hand shuffle for the Boogie Woogie. Once you've got used to the left hand pattern and the um, 12 bar blues, we can look at all sorts of right hand patterns. You know, there's just, just countless that you can have fun with. Um, and I'm really excited to show you a bunch of those. So that is coming soon. I actually recorded a video, so something like the five or the six must know chord progression or, or something like that. I spent the day recording it, spent the day editing it, and then scrapped it. Um, I didn't like it, it was forgettable, you know, it wasn't really, um, I felt like I was just giving you chord progressions and then going, go on, go away, practice it, and do it and stuff. It wasn't really what I was about. I want to give you tools that underline it to spark that creativity. So that video is coming. Um, but I need to think about how I can actually add some value to it so that you guys get something above and beyond just some random chord progressions. I am going to carry on with the Piano in 60 Seconds videos. Now, the idea behind those Piano in 60 Seconds videos is it gives you something you can just access straight away. You know, you might come home from work, you might be tired, you know, and you don't want to really sit down at that piano and have to, like, face the prospect of mental energy, you know. Now, don't get me wrong, you need to do that. Um, but sometimes it's just not possible and if you'd rather sit at that piano anyway and, and my, my hope is that you'll sit at that piano and just take these videos as what they are, little tiny nuggets of awesomeness that you can just sit down, play the two minute video, play the one minute video or whatever and have some fun. They're going really good, I'm really enjoying doing them, um, it gives me a chance to get some ideas off my chest as well. So I'm still continuously looking at how I can add value to my videos and make sure that you're getting something above and beyond just normal simple standard stuff to inspire you, to get you creative and what I would recommend you do right now is you're obviously watching this YouTube channel because you're interested in learning piano, you know, you must be passionate about it on some level so use that passion, ride it and feed it and nurture it so that uh, you don't get bored because trust me that that will go away if you don't um, work on it. So make sure you sit at that piano, use these videos, and you know, if you need a video to just get going, if you're a complete beginner, I have just put a video up on the YouTube channel called the five, uh, the top five piano exercises for beginners, something like that, it's really good. It goes over everything you need to do, everything you need to know to just sit at that piano and get playing it, so do check that out. Looks like my coffee's ready, so I'm gonna take that as fuel and get editing some videos for you guys. Um, one thing I did wanna say was, Keep an eye on the uh, vlog playlist, you know, what this video is under because it's where I post the more fun videos so that you can get to know who I am and I can get to your, you know you a bit better and it just shows you a different side to me other than the guy who just teaches you piano so hopefully this is a little bit of fun for you. I'm actually off to India in February so hopefully I'll get to introduce you to my in-laws who are currently living in Calcutta so that's all to come. Thank you so much for being subscribers to this channel, it means a great deal to me. It means that I know I'm on the right track and it inspires me to continue making these videos. So use them, you know, get inspired, use them to become better pianists and most importantly, have fun. So until next time, I will see you in the next video. That is how you fill a cup of coffee.